Get to go make some more money today. You know, that's one thing I can say. I like to have neighbors. I really do. Because you know what? It's good to help out one another. And see, when you got a good neighbor, you know I mean, a really good neighbor that you can go bullshit with, you know, just to go chill with and talk to and shit. That watches over each other like he bought a shit. He's like, man, hey, Pop, you need anything that you want to get out of the weather or not? Your mother welcome put in my shed. Nigga even gave me a spare key to the shed. And then he just went by him a lot more. You're saying, guess what? Got a key to that too. So that's one thing I can say. It's good to have neighbors because you know what? You help him, you help your neighbor out, they help you out. You know what I mean? If you ever go on vacation or ever not home, they'll watch your shit for you. They'll watch and make sure nobody goes fuck around your shit and all that. Just like, see, my neighbor goes to work, he knows. His property is taken care of because I'll cut the grass for him. I'll weed eat it for him. And I'll make sure nobody goes over there and fucks around his shit. None of that. Like all my cameras, they go on his shit. His cameras do the same thing. They pop around my, they point towards my house too. So we watch out for one another. That's the good thing about having neighbors because you watch out for each other. He watches out for you. My place, I watch out for his. If I ever need something, hey, all I got to do is go over there and you know. Like yesterday, I want me and old lady, we had the money. And when someone's like, man, let's go get another sofa. It'd be good to have two sofas because, you know, a lot of times we got company that comes over and they ain't got places to sit. So I was like, yeah, fuck yeah, let's do it. So we didn't have a truck because right now all we got is a car. So what we did... I went knocking on my neighbor's door. I went over there and asked my neighbor, lady, bring your mom, bring me to Lafayette to go get a look at some sofas. Oh, yeah, I got to uh, I gotta go out there anyway. So we rode together. Yesterday, I went and helped him and uh, his old lady. His old lady just finally moved in with him. So I helped her and him and her pack all her stuff from her house, bring it over here to his house. So... You know, we help out of one of us. So that is one, that's a good thing about having neighbors. And like, if I see somebody on my cameras, around in my yard, all I got to call him. That fool's coming outside with the fucking AR. Or he coming outside with his 911. Either way, he's coming outside because like he tells anybody, he don't fuck around. He's a Marine. He ain't scared to put a, put, put a bullet. He's just scared of the consequences. But he doesn't say he don't fuck around. Nobody's going to fuck around his place. Nobody's going to fuck around mine. And that's the good thing about having, you know, good neighbors. That's the good thing about being cool with your neighbors. And friendly to your neighbors and stuff, you know. He knows his place look, is, you know, okay. I know my place is okay. We both know, you know, that both of our place is okay. So, you know, that's the beauty about that, about having neighbors. We take care of each other. We help at each other. You know, just like you got a neighbor way over there on the other side. You know, he looks out for me too. Like when he sees a vehicle going around the block, he'll call me, hey, Pop, they got somebody coming around the block. Like, I would get a call when I'm at my house. I could be in work in my yard, hey, man. He got his vehicle creeping around the block. Hey, man, there's a vehicle creeping around. Hey, man, there's cops coming around the block. Like, he's always calling me. So, you know what? It's good to have neighbors because we look out for one another. Because we know when people don't belong out here. We know when we see new vehicles and all that. Because it ain't often people just come ride around back here and none of that. Unless they come and visit somebody. They ain't coming just out here just to joy ride. Nobody comes way the fuck out here just to fucking joy ride. No one just comes way out here. The only way you come way the fuck out here if you're not visiting nobody is to start shit with somebody. Come on. The dog's okay. The swole's not going to hurt you. Donkey don't like big swole. She's scared of them. That's what donkeys are for, though. They're to keep other predators away. Like if a coyote comes through here, try to attack my ch chicken, or like when I'm about to get I'm about to get some cows and some horses. I'm gonna get like two horses and like two two or three cows, and I need her because she's gonna keep them coyotes and dogs and shit away. That's why big swole stays way over there because here he knows. The donkey, he comes any closer, don't he kick him. Like my black dog, I don't let him loose. 
because she's done beat the shit out of his ass. Oh boy, she beat the fuck out. You should see a nigga fly. Oh, I ain't joking. That nigga flew. That bitch kicked him, but that nigga flew, y'all. He right, he's alright though. I promise he ain't gonna come nowhere near. Don't kick you no. Know. <laughs>